Hi, in this video, I am sharing the status update related to our regional scrum gathering. This seems to be the last status update for this particular gathering which we are having on 29th and 30th March in Hyderabad. So I am looking into four areas in my status update. One is about speakers. So how can we learn from others? Opportunities there. The second one is about the delegates, the networking opportunities. The third one is sharing your knowledge or learning from each other. So we have an open space. I want to talk about it. And the fourth thing is about engagement with Scrum Alliance. So we, we are going to have a good number of Scrum Alliance staff present in the, in the gathering and I want to share some of the details there. So let's get started and talk about the speakers. Yeah, so we decided to keep the proposals open for, for an extended duration and it created a lot of work for us and I must appreciate the amount of work, amount of time the reviewer put into reviewing the proposals. We got around 170 proposals for 23 slots and it was a tough job and I do understand it was a subjective judgment. So there's a possibility that there are there were some good proposals and we could not fit them because of the availability of space in the gathering. But all in all, we tried our best as a review group, as a gathering team to find out the best possible talks for you. And the speakers are coming from different cultures, different countries. And in my view, it's going to be very interesting to get insights from them. We spoke about our keynote speakers before and you might be already knowing it. The agenda is complete. There might be some changes in, in shuffling some of the talks from here to there because of some inputs. But in general, the overall agenda is published at our website. So please make good use of it identify which all talks you want to attend to because there is going to be parallel talks and I, I think this is going to be a difficult decision as well since we spend that much energy to find out best speakers for you. Now about delegates and about networking. Now I personally find many participants coming to the gatherings in order to increase their network. They want to connect with the fellow professionals. And I appreciate that need and for that what we initiated is we have a created a WhatsApp group for the conference delegates. Now as on today we have 100 participants already joined in and as people are enrolling to this particular event we are inviting them to join to, to that particular WhatsApp group. So this is an hour effort to create a networking opportunity even before you come face to face during the gathering. And if you remain active in those groups, it increases your chance to meet more people and remain connected with those people even after the gathering. And what I hear from my team is the group is having good amount of interactions. So please make good use of it and start your networking effort from now. You don't have to wait for the 29th to come. Now about learning from each others. We have created a space called open space. Now many times this open space get created or get scheduled at the end of the conference, towards the end of the conference and it, it results into most of the participants start leaving during those open space and, and, and the, the energy level goes down. So we thought about it, we thought about that there is a need since we could not even cater all this, the proposals as well and we do appreciate that delegates might be knowing many things which can be of interest of other delegates. So we designed the open space and carefully we planned it in the first half of second day and and which in, in our perspective will create probability of more and more part participant participating in the open space. The second thing is after connecting in open space and if you find some interesting topics and you want to know more about it you still have a time because there is still half a day left after the open space. And on top of it, if you want to speak in the open space, we are also giving you an opportunity to talk about your idea even now, even before starting the conference. So we have scheduled series of webinar where the delegates who wish to talk in open space can talk about their idea through webinars. So yesterday we started and we are seeing good response related to it. So if you are thinking of Speaking in open space, I would recommend connect with our team and schedule a webinar about your topic so that the other delegates comes to know in advance about your thoughts. Finally, about Scrum Alliance engagement. 
So Scrum Alliance is taking this conference quite seriously and good number of Scrum Alliance staff would be, would be interacting physically face to face with you during the gathering. The Scrum Alliance servant leader, they call it chief product owner, chief Scrum master, uh, Howard is also going to be present during this particular conference. So there is education team members are there. So many members of Scrum Alliance are there who would like to know uh, your ideas, how can they, how can your idea help them in transforming the world of work. So if you have some suggestions, if you want to get some insights about their way of looking at things, this is the opportunity which you can use. So think about what would you like to talk with Scrum Alliance staff and you will get an opportunity on 29th and 30th March. Yeah, so these are the four things I wanted to talk. I am looking forward to see you on 29th and 30th March in our Hyderabad gathering.